वेलकम बैक थैंक्स लॉट फॉर स्टेइंग विद अस वी गेटिंग सम ब्रेकिंग डेवलपमेंट्स नाउ कमिंग इन सम न्यूज कमिंग इन फ्रॉम द नेशनल कैपिटल वेयर वी आर अंडरस्टैंडिंग अ थेफ्ट वर्थ 20 क्रोस फ्रॉम अ ज्वेलरी शोरूम हैज नाउ बीन रिपोर्टेड वी आर अंडरस्टैंडिंग द थीव्स अलेजेडली मेड अ होल थ्रू द वॉल टू रीच इनसाइड एंड देन पिक अप ऑर्नामेंट्स अकॉर्डिंग टू द ओनर्स द इंसिडेंट टुक प्लेस लेट लास्ट नाइट दिस इज अ ज्वेलर कॉल्ड उमराव ज्वेलर्स वी विल ट्राई एंड गेट मोर डिटेल्स बट एज़ फार एज़ अथॉरिटीज ऑन द ग्राउंड द क्राइम टीम इज ऑल्सो now saying they've managed to scan the cctv footage the cameras that were installed and they have been working on leads as of now so a big story that is developing from the national capital a theft as we pointed out has been reported a theft worth 20 crores let's also now bring in our colleague deepak bish who in fact is joining us on the broadcast deepak aap hame bataiye ki ye ghatna kab ghati police ka kya kehna hai kitne log milkar inhone ye chori kari देखिए जो ये घटना है उसका पता आज सुबह तकरीबन दस बजे के आसपास चला है क्योंकि सोमवार को ये दुकान बंद रहती है और दुकान के जो मालिक है उनका कहना है कि 25 करोड़ की चोरी उनके दुकान के अंदर हुई है मैं दिखाना चाहूंगा ये उमराव ज्वेलर्स का जो शटर है ये इस वक्त पुलिस ने यहाँ पर थोड़ा डाउन किया हुआ है क्योंकि उमराव ज्वेलर्स कई साल पुरानी शोरूम है जहाँ पर जो दावा किया गया है कि स्ट्रांग रूम में संडे की शाम को क्योंकि सैटरडे संडे शॉप खुलती है और काफी गहमा गहमी रहती है उसके बाद संडे की शाम को सारा जो ज्वेलरी का सामान था सब स्ट्रांग रूम में जो आपको दिखाई दे रहा है टीवी स्क्रीन पर ये स्ट्रांग रूम है और यहाँ पर डाल दिया गया था और उसके बाद दुकान स्वामी अपने घर चले गए थे अगले दिन सोमवार को यहाँ मार्केट बंद रहती है तो दुकान यहाँ पर बंद रखी थी लेकिन जो चोर है वो बड़े छातिर निकले हैं उन्होंने सबसे पहले इलेक्ट्रिसिटी यहाँ पर काटी है जो दुकान के ठीक बाहर था उसके बाद वो छत के रास्ते यहाँ पर रास्ता बनाते हुए अंदर घुसे हैं और अब ये देखिए तस्वीरें आपको यहाँ से जो तस्वीरें दिखाई दे रही है ये स्ट्रांग रूम के पास की तस्वीरें हैं और यहाँ पर सारी ज्वेलरी रखी गई थी जिसमें चांदी को कम हाथ लगाया गया था चोरों के द्वारा जबकि जो गोल्ड और जो हीरे जवाहरात हैं उनको ज्यादा यहाँ से चुरा कर ले गए हैं हालांकि पुलिस का कहना है कि अभी सीसीटीवी फुटेज उनको नहीं मिल पा रहा है क्योंकि इलेक्ट्रिसिटी का सप्लाई बंद होने की वजह से सीसीटीवी बंद हो गए थे और चोरों ने इसका इस्तेमाल किया था और इसी वजह से ये पूरी घटना हुई है और अब पुलिस पुलिस की टीम और जो दुकान के मालिक हैं उनसे बातचीत की जा रही है जो ओनर है वो यहाँ पर अभी तक यही आंकड़ा बता रहे हैं कि उनका तकरीबन पच्चीस करोड़ का सामान चोरी हुआ है जी दीपक जो ओनर्स है उनका क्या कहना है क्या उनका किसी पर शक है अभी तक पुलिस का क्या कहना है कि इस तरह के लीड्स हैं उनके पास देखिए अभी तक पुलिस Okay, we'll just request Deepak to stay on with us. Let's also now bring in our colleague Anshul, who's also joining us on the broadcast. Anshul, I'll take the same question to you. What are the owners saying? Do they have suspicion? Could it be a case of personal enmity? What are authorities on the ground saying? What are the kind of leads that they have? Uh, so yes, the police has just reached on the ground. They are investig- investigating the case. As of now, the owners have just told an approximate amount of uh, what has been stolen. Uh, what sources ha- have confirmed that yes, there are a, there is a suspicion on a few people who are actually bad characters in that area, and hence their rounding up process has started. Whereas the uh, police has also managed to get the CCTV of the entire uh, incident of the entire ti- uh, timeline at which uh, this uh, incident might have happened. Post that, we can expect some. a uh, clarity as to if, if if at all anyone known uh, to the uh, to the owners was uh, was the accused who had actually planned and plotted this entire thing or if at all this uh, this was some uh, someone else or some bad character in that area who had actually uh, planted this entire entire story and, and had gone ahead and made this entire entire uh, big crime but as of now the owners are claiming that the amount of uh, things stolen from the shop could be more than rupees 20 uh, 20 crores and that has what has been mentioned in the fi that has been registered the investigation is still on uh, but yes we are expecting some more details to come out uh, okay. very soon as the investigation is ongoing by the senior officials of the delhi police so as anshul is pointing out that the case has been registered the authorities say that they do have some positive leads to work with anshul a colleague deepak was just narrating the sequence of events for us it is done in a very smart manner the thieves came they cut the electricity first they tried to make use of the fact the shop is shut on mondays could you talk to us about what are the kind of initial details that you're picking up uh, so yes this was uh, this was a thing that was actually very very planned and this looks like a a uh, see a crime scene that has been committed by a professional uh, a criminal because yes as you rightly mentioned that since shops are closed on monday uh, the the day was specifically selected and also uh, the electricity supply uh, supply was cut just to make sure that the cctv footage of that uh, of that uh, 
shop is is not recorded but yes the police what the police has confirmed to us is that there are a few visuals in which the accused uh, can, can be uh, can be seen uh, the footages of the nearby area is also being collected of the of the cameras that have been uh, put across that street the cctv footages of that, uh, that those also are being collected along with that the cctv footages of the nearby uh, okay. uh, Yeah, by shops is has also been picked up by the police. So the process of looking into that the CCTV footages and looking into the, those DVR tapes is still on. The police has confiscated all those DVR tapes in the nearby area. The, okay. They are looking into it. But yes, in the in the next few hours, we might get more details if at all the police is able to identify that person through uh, uh, if if at all that person is a bad character in that area or if that uh, okay. person might have come uh, come from some other area to commit this crime. That would be clear in the next few hours. Okay, Anshul, keep a close eye on all those developments.